We are going to start uh, Pac-12 Media Day here with Arizona State. The Sun Devils picked second. Uh, we're in election time of the year, and this one was very close as well. Uh, UCLA first, Arizona State second. Uh, Remy Martin now joins us. And Remy, um, you made a pretty important decision in your life to decide to return to ASU. You could have opted to obviously uh, go to the NBA draft, which is next week. What was the driving force as to why you returned, decided to return to Tempe? I think it was just the best decision for Remy Martin. You know, um, I think that, you know, the year that I had was I was able to, you know, do those things, uh, enter the draft and, you know, due to pandemic, you know, I didn't get to, you know, have the full experience that I wanted to um, and working out with teams and everything like that. But on the flip side, the, the safety net of being able to come back to Tempe. Um, that's probably one of the best ball bags you could ever have, right? I, I had a blast here. Um, the people here are amazing. The coaching staff, my teammates, it was such a hard decision to leave. But now that I'm here, um, it was probably one of the best decisions for me and I'm, I'm happy to be here. So you're on the ground, we are not. Uh, two incredible freshmen coming in, in uh, Bagley and Christopher. Um, give us the scouting report. What have you seen in practice uh, for these two individuals and, and the manner in which that they'll have an impact on this team? Um, those two individuals, man, are some of the best freshmen I've ever played with. You know, man, it was just their, their grit, their desire to win, their desire to play um, basketball is at an all-time high. I mean, Marcus Bagley, he's, he's been, you know, killing in practice. You know, he's been stretching the floor. He's been hitting – open shots, um, making plays, dunking a ball, weak side blocks. It's just fun to play, right? It's, it reminds me a little bit of a Zylan Cheatham um, when I played with him, just working hard, doing whatever he needs to do for the team. And Josh, man, he's just a, a, a basketball player. He loves to play. He, he scores the ball well, and he brings that energy. You know, when, when people are down, he's, he's happy to be in the gym. He wants to play basketball. And when you have people that love to play basketball and love to win, um, it always is fun to play. And, and Remy, how long did it take you to be in sync with a fellow point guard playmaker in Bobby Hurley? Oh, my God. Since, uh, since my junior year when I committed in high school, um, you know, just being able to, to know more about Coach Hurley, you know, what he's done in his life um, is everything I want to accomplish in my life. I want to win a national championship. I want to, you know, make it to the NBA one day. Um, and just like I said, the desire to play basketball, the, the love I have for the game and seeing him, the love he has for the game, the intensity that he brings on the floor, um, we clicked right away. I mean, he went, when we had the home visit, when I committed and he came up to my house, we had this big party, like, you know, usually home visits are like four or five people, right? My family is huge. So we had like, you know, 30 people there. Um, and I just wanted him to know that he's part of my family now and, and uh, it's been great ever since.